Hey, how you doing today? I am Tequila Coleman. In today's video, we're going to talk about destroying every argument that's going on inside of your prodigal spouse's mind. Listen, scripture tell us in 2 Corinthians 10 verse 5, it say we demolish arguments in every pretension that set itself up against the knowledge of God and we take captive every thought to make it obedient to Christ. There's arguments going on inside of your prodigal spouse's mind concerning whether or not they should come home or not, right? There's arguments going on, you know, um, about things that happened in the past, right? And so you want to stand on this scripture in 2 Corinthians chapter 10 verse 5 and you want to begin to cover your spouse in prayer, you know, and you want to begin to just press in in prayer and say, God, according to your word in 2 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 5, I demolish every argument and every pretension that is setting itself up against the knowledge of God. And I take captive every thought to make it obedient to Christ. So if you know whatever that argument is, like think about the things that your spouse keep bringing up, right? If they keep blaming you for something, go ahead and take that thought captive and make it obedient to Christ. If they keep, you know, um, you know, like being double-minded concerning certain things. You want to demolish that argument, okay? Double mind, double minus me. You're 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 thinking two different thoughts, okay? So you want to begin to demolish that argument that's going on inside of your spouse's mind, and this is how you do it by reminding God of His Word in 2 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 5, and you want to take that thought captive and make it obedient to Christ. And then after you do that, you want to begin to decree um, to the spirit realm what your spouse will think on, okay? So in Philippians chapter 4, verse 8, it say, think on whatever is true, whatever is noble, whatever is right, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is admirable, if anything is excellent or praiseworthy, think about such things. So I want you to decree, use your authority. Job said, thou shalt decree a thing and it shall be established. So here's how this works. You're going to start with 2 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 5. Say, Father, you said that we are to demolish every argument and every pretension that set itself up against the knowledge of God. And we take captive every thought to make it obedient to Christ. So, Father, I'm demolishing every argument that's going on inside of my prodigal spouse's mind in the name of Jesus Christ. And we are making it obedient to Christ. And I decree that you will, I decree my prodigal spouse will think on whatever is true, whatever is noble, whatever is right, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is admirable. If anything is excellent or praiseworthy, you will think about such things according to Philippians 4 or 8 in Jesus' name. It's time to take authority over the enemy attacking your spouse's mind okay so begin to turn this into your prayer point and begin to decree to the spirit realm what your prodigal spouse will begin to think on okay that is it i am tequila coleman i'll talk to you real soon take care